everyone welcome back to my youtube channel i know you guys missed me but i have a reason why i've been such a ghost hi guys welcome back to the channel so um it's like half past 12 now it's my last day of study leave i'm writing tomorrow officially i'll be writing at about 9 a.m until 11 so we're doing cia part two um again <laughs> um if you don't know what happened when i say again please go to the previous video where i explain um failing cia part two in 2022 but um anyways uh, so I've revised. Um, I just want to take a break now. Um, I look like this because, yeah, I need to go take a shower. And then I want to just hit the gym just to relax my mind, feel good. Um, and then I'll come back and just do like uh, a pre-run again, 100 questions. The last time I did 100 questions was on Tuesday. Today's Thursday. And I had gotten like 75%. made really silly mistakes. So I want to just practice again and hopefully get something above 80 um, and then I'll be comfortable and then I think I'm just gonna wrap up by reading the implementation guides and that's it We just hit the road tomorrow and we go get the CIA So guys, this was me um, Busy prepping you Can see my stuff all over Yeah, so Let's do this. Um, I love highlighting and, and, and all of that. So I'm a big fan of making notes and stuff, but yeah So I'm gonna use my passport. But um, yeah, I'm going in. Uh, 30 minutes left. I made it on time thanks to my bro ski. Thank you, boy. Um, but yeah, guys, I feel ready. I feel okay. It is what it is. Let's go do this. God got me. Shop. Guys, so I'm at the mall now. <clears throat> gonna enjoy, spend the rest of my day celebrating and so I got this from Starbucks I told them that I passed and I didn't know they even wrote congratulations but I love my caramel frappuccino so this is really nice so if you're watching me for the first time thank you for clicking this video and please join the family and subscribe for my returning subscribers, lots of love to you guys. We keep learning. So uh, my name is Gift Somagwabi, also known as Soma K. And you know the title, Young Internal Auditor and so forth and so forth. I'm not going to go on that, but I just want to let you guys know that you are now looking at your Emerge Africa uh, Youth Empowerment Ambassador for 2024. So I received that award on the 26th, uh, oh no, I'm confusing it, on the 6th of April. Sorry guys, there's a reason why 26 is special. I'll get to it now, but um, so yeah, the girl got the Youth Empowerment Award Ambassador. So everybody that voted for me, much love guys. I truly, truly appreciate you. To be honest, I didn't think I was gonna get the award. And I know it sounds weird because it's like gift, but you're always so motivated. And But the truth is, I had no confidence that I'm going to get it. And the reason why I say this is, first of all, I know what you guys don't like voting with money. Anything that has to do with SMSs and all of that, like, it was just a lot of work. So that really also discouraged me. And five rand is a lot per SMS. But clearly, because... I'm the one who got it. It's clear that you guys obviously love me and and that really came through for me. Um, it was a really funny day. The way I got the award was weird because I got to the venue. We got there late. Get to the venue and somebody decides to go to the bathroom. And I decided to also go to the bathroom not knowing that the line is going to take such a you know whole drag and whatever 
but then now they've already started announcing the winners right and i seriously did not hear anything like gift use them nothing so then we get to the table and we're sitting there and you know so the process was you, you get called you go to the stage you say a speech and then you get pictures and all that right so i'm there like okay this moment i can't wait for it all right we're on the seventh award we're on the tenth award we're on the twelfth award hey there's nothing coming what's going on okay now they announced the last award how what about me guys like what about okay if it's not me who won then okay cool we're getting ready to leave and then something's just like let me just ask at least let me leave here knowing that even if i didn't get it i can at least maybe congratulate the person who got it and i would like to meet them and see why they won and what they do right so i go to one of the ladies that was in the same category as me and i ask her so do you know who won um youth empowerment ambassador and she's like it's some guy called gift firstly i'm not a guy secondly <laughs> i'm not a guy but i understand why people get confused so i'm confused because i'm like i don't remember another gift that's a guy in the same category my name is gift so what's happening you know so i went to the director or the owner of the, the thing and she's like um i asked her who won and she's like uh it's a it's a person called gift and i was like my name is gift and she asked for my surname i gave her my surname she's like girl we called your name and we didn't see you i'm like no i went to the bathroom she was like go and fetch your award child and i'm there like what so now the emotions are high i'm shocked now it's like how i won okay i need content okay i need pictures okay i need like i'm processing everything i'm like no ways and um my plus one is there like you know supporting obviously pictures and everything and obviously giving me that look like ah mara <laughs> you now missed the whole thing you didn't get to take pictures you didn't get to to feel the you know and it's funny because um when we're actually on the way one of the highlights was are you ready for your speech like have you prepared a speech and i kept i kept saying nah i don't need that because i don't want to disappoint myself and look now it all went back on me because at the end of the day i was actually supposed to have a speech but um guys that's yeah that's one of the things that i wanted to just share with you so thank you so much guys we've been collecting from 2022 2023 and now 2024 but i i mentioned the 26th right and i said there's a reason why that date is so important uh, but before we get into that let's just backtrack all the way to 2022 specifically december what happened in december 2022 so what happened is okay let me even go back all the way to november so i found out that i was left with a month before my cia is about to expire right the, for the exam part two and i didn't know that you could actually have like an extension where you can pay i think about 1.5 to move the date over i just decided you know what let me just go and study i can I, I literally just i remember calling my mentor and i was like okay if i start studying tomorrow and that means i'd have like three and a half weeks or something do you think that's enough time for me to actually understand this you know and she's like yeah because of the experience you know you kind of like you know finishing the first year of your your career it's not bad and stuff like that i'm like yo i'm i'm scared because i failed part one in june and now i'm attempting two already like you know what are the odds and okay she motivated me and i was like i was really encouraged i'm like you know what girl we're gonna start grinding you know and it's hard because guys get december like honestly studying in december is not easy i tried it last year sure it worked but it's really not easy so okay i'm in my grind mode now okay i'm trying to study i'm trying to study this content Whew, yeah okay the day comes for me to write nah? i get to santon i remember I, I booked in santon this is the same place that i wrote part one and i'm just like yo the trauma the trauma the only good thing about Sinton was this time i knew where to go the first time i was so lost and that affected my brain and i was just anxious right 
but it 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 just it still felt the same like it still felt like i'm going to the same space where i failed it was just i just I, oh, it was just bad and another thing i only had the slot for 4 p.m so my issue is guys writing at the end of the day is just not that great cool if you really need to write and that's the only time slot but it's really not the best i wouldn't advise right so i got there i think at about two went to starbucks got myself some frappuccino and i was just sitting there revising revising another mistake revising a few hours before your paper bad idea so anyways cool i get to the venue i'm writing i'm writing i'm writing and this is a two hour paper 100 questions by six i'm done yeah. man gives me his pay my pay oh sorry my paper he gives me the paper and and Santon is so dramatic because like guys this is how they give you the paper like this guy knows that you failed man and he's giving you your paper like this and you you need to now open this thing and look at how bad, <laughs> how bad you did I need to go home with that depressing mark and then yo i was not fine like it just triggered me and i just didn't understand what i keep getting wrong you know and it's so weird because the same place i wrote at around the, about the same time i got the same mark exactly the same mark for part one so it felt like a curse at this point like ah uh, yeah it's not make sure so i made sure that for part one i'm not writing in sentence anymore apologies sentence but it's just not for me so okay cool now let's go to the 26th what actually happened now okay so i decided to pursue the cia again after passing part one i was really motivated like you know ah after december i'm like yo well, other people are enjoying january i'm in okay january happened i i was not in feb i kind of started starting okay i started getting into the mode okay and then march started coming through and then i remember speaking to um you know because like we have a very supportive group so certain people that i speak to and one of the issues was booking so I remember telling you guys that it's very important to book right but don't obviously book too far ahead because you never know what might happen and the changes you need to make but one thing that really needed me to be you know serious was for me to actually play now and, and actually book so the day i decided to 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 look at a date that i could possibly write i started getting into grind mode i started you know pushing I, I tried i really tried my best to to dedicate you know a few hours after work before work um if i was idle in between like i really tried i'd watch videos here and there you know and one thing that also helped me was just the the, the previous part two that i wrote and i kind of had an idea of what it's like and because now i'm in my third year I feel like two and two years and like three months of experience was much better than the seven eight months that I had in first year. So now when I was studying, I could actually relate to a lot of the content because I've done this before. So we went and we wrote on the twenty sixth of April, and I used the same formula for part one, guys. I didn't revise um, a few hours before. I made sure that I was in that atmosphere of you know um of prayer and i remember sharing the song with you guys um by ukolega meaning that um it's according to isaiah 55 i just love the song i love this verse oh it just literally says like it's literally telling you that you will not leave empty-handed and that's what i believe that i will not go to this venue and come back with nothing you know so this time i wrote in main lane because there was no space in the previous venue that i wrote for part one um so i was in that atmosphere i was just like thanking god for what he's about to do what he's already done because um one thing i've learned that guys um when you're in the spirit it's just the physical eye that needs to catch up later so you know that you, you already got this but the physical needs to now come in and cool we, we went um i remember i went with my brother and he dropped me off and um even actually just to backtrack the day before 
I decided to chill. I was watching cartoons. I was, I was so relaxed. I was, you know, I, I did a bit of exercises and I was like, this is mine. This is mine. I'm coming back with this. I, I'm not doing part two again. And we wrote. The exam was, whoo. It was weird. Like, I feel like it was easy, but I feel like every answer I was choosing, I don't know if it was right. Okay, so I get out of the venue, the moment you submit and you're done, the person who's in charge is ready to print out your result. So this guy is printing out a paper and I didn't realize he's printing out my paper. And what usually happens is if you failed, you get a whole breakdown. If you passed, it's written pass. So I see this thing. Oh, it doesn't have anything, guys. Oh. This is the paper that told me that I passed. So I was so excited. I was so happy. I was shocked. I think out of everything, I was shocked. I was like, what? I'm left with one. So guys, um, <laughs> I don't want to say a lot. I think uh, I will give more uh, insights and breakdowns on some of the techniques that I've seen have been working from part one to part two. And I'm still going to use that for part three. But basically, guys, your girl is one part away from being certified. I am almost there, guys. So anytime from now, anytime from now, you will hear that Gift Somagwabe is a certified internal auditor. So, guys, um, if you have any questions, um, if you'd like to just... Um, find out what i use i really started getting questions from linkedin and, 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 and instagram um we will be hosting a session um and i'll be bringing in uh, a few people with certain knowledge with regards to cia i remember i did share guys i shared with you guys information on wood institute and so forth so um please be on the lookout for information and when we'll have a session about that and ways to tackle it and 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 how to actually onboard with wood institute as well um but besides that thank you guys so much for your love and your support and voting for your girl and just being part of this journey from failure to actually making it guys it is really really possible um and i love you guys so much and i'll see you guys on the next video 